questionsfordutch at gmail.com. If you want to get your question sent into this show, that is the only way to do it. Questionsfordutch at gmail.com. And as I say, thank you so much for everyone who does do that. We get dozens and dozens and dozens every single week. It's very, very hard to pick uh, the ones uh, that we are uh, going to end up in the script. And if someone writes in something that we've addressed before, uh, someone from the email people will hopefully write you back and tell you and send you a link and everything so you don't feel like you've been ignored either. Yes, Dutch? I forgot what I was going to say now. Oh, but man. sometimes we say, well, you may enjoy it, you may not, but that I, they will enjoy this one. Oh, you've got something to say. You've got something to say from one of these questions, I know. Oh, I I do. So stay tuned, folks. Okay, then. First one is Luke. Hey, Dutch. Since Hulk Hogan claimed he had 24-inch pythons, there were other guys with huge arms like Jeep Swenson, Scott Steiner, and Billy Graham. Braun Strowman made an Instagram post saying he had 25-inch arms. Who do you think really had the biggest arms in wrestling? Well, I never met Jeep Swenson, but his arms look bigger to me. Then Huck Hogan's dead. And uh, the arms I like the best because I saw them every night I was in the dressing room with him was Scott Steiner. <laughs> you know, if you went in the in a dressing room with Scott Steiner, he was gonna show you those arms. I mean, you, you can't you can't get out of there without noticing them anyway. But uh see the arms are one thing, but it's According to how tall the guy is, I think the shorter the guy, the arms look bigger. I think with Hulk, they didn't look as big as they were. Do you think they were 24 inches? Are you saying that Hulk Hogan might exaggerate the truth slightly? Well, he's kind of tall, so he's kind of lanky-like, I yeah. think. So yeah. it was, that would make his arms look actually smaller than what he's claiming. But who knows what a 24-inch arm looks like anyway? Most people wouldn't know that. I mean, you measure your arms, they, they're 16 inches, 18, whatever they are. But uh, 24 inch python, brother. You know, do you know, so, do you know you're just saying with height, he, with height, I was, I'm sorry to interrupt you. I was going to say, do you know who had big arms that was very short back in the day? Ivan Putsky. Yes, he, because he was, I was right, correct? Shorter they are, I mean, his arms look bigger than what they actually are. Because you take a 24-inch arm on Pusky, that'd be half his chest almost. So he would look just massive. <clears throat> Hulk being taller, they're going to look, from a distance, I'm saying, they're going to look, I don't think they they look 24 inches. Or you can't look at them and say, oh, that's 23 and three-quarter. You don't know. So he could call them anything. He could call them 25-inch arms, really. But who said he had 25-inch arms? Braun Strowman? Braun Strowman claims that, yeah. Do you think he has 25-inch arms? It's, as you say, it's sort of tough to say because you're looking at someone on a picture or on video. You don't get the full scale of the height of the guy. But maybe? Oh, he's a big, he's a big guy. So. Do, do you know, um, uh, my, my man Don Morocco has claimed that he, uh, and I believe him, he had bigger arms than Hulk Hogan did. Uh, he had big arms. He yeah, did. he was a big old dude uh, and mm -hmm. still is a big old dude as Don. Um, who had the best arms in the business then? Are you going to say Scott's? So let's say, you know, um, um, uh, build a wrestler and you could take anybody's arms from the business and have them as your own. Who's, whose would you pick as far as uh, size, vascularity and all that kind of thing? The, the arms that you covet. <laughs> Mascularity. Uh, the, uh, Muscularity. The vascularity, the veins. Oh, okay, baby. okay, okay, okay. No, I think Scott, Scott had those arms, but he had the triceps too. It's not just the, the biceps, it's the triceps. If you got big triceps, you got a, you, you got a big arm. So, but you know, they can be so big, they look freakish. So I would rather, <clears throat> I think Scott standing there, he has great looking arms just in a picture and but I like when the deltoids come out and then the bind, you know, the triceps come out and, you know, they're standing there. And so I think the overall package, I think Scott had the whole package. Do you know who had the best triceps? Sid. He oh, had Sid some had triceps on him. And, you know, Sid, uh, a, a lot of guys have a great upper body, but their lower body, kind of their legs, like, you know, used to jokes that they missed leg day. 
They don't go on leg day. Like a Bob Rick Arms- Rude. Yeah. Bob Armstrong was like that. Bob Armstrong always had those big arms, and I don't know if they weren't the 24 inches, but they were probably 20. He had he had big arms, but his legs, he had no legs at all. He had no, uh, you know, the top leg and the bottom leg, the calves. He didn't have that. And he's a kind of a tall guy, too, but he had great-looking arms. 